So what's good? Back with another review. So I'm gonna show you guys that I got these guys also as a order and a pickup. So as you can see in the back, the four tubs right there basically to put them inside or bins you wanna say. So just wanna show you exactly what I got as the pickup. So right here we got a pink toe. So this is a I guess it's like a juvenile, I'll say. Well, they pretty much still is babies. I'll, I'll say, they pretty much babies. They ain't slings, but you know, they, they decent size. They ain't grown men yet, and grown women. I gotta figure out the sex too. So this one I believe is like 30. I believe that was overpriced too as well. But the fact that I wanted it, and it was in the heat of the moment, purchased it. This one, let me start off. I don't know this one $55 so yeah pretty much I got these from a, like a seller like a basically like a person that do like um them expos and stuff so pretty much some of these prices was kind of like him getting you know their little fee and they're winning for selling them you know but it ain't no real big difference because when you think about when you order online there ain't no real big difference between ordering online and buying them in person because the shipping and handling to order these guys online are usually like 50 maybe 40 dollars so it's like it's vice versa so basically the shipping and handling if i was to order these three i basically got an extra one off the shipping and handling so it's like a win situation because i wanted them anyway so that's the best win so this is a white knee as you can see it's still small white knee about $75 definitely was up there but I don't mind nobody making a couple extra dollars off selling them you know you're selling them you know you want to make a couple extra dollars but that definitely was up there in price range as far as this one as well these two look alike but they are not the same so as you can see the name of them stripe knee and that's the Pacific name for that you can name them for like they basically they background of their real heritage but we just gonna say stripe knee for short but some people call them by that long name and this is the white knee just showed you that they look alike I think this one is most likely gonna get bigger than this one but this one so far right now is beating it pink toe ain't really that ain't really doing nothing I can't really I ain't gonna really show you and this is the curly head about fifty dollars for a curly head definitely was overpriced but that's what happens when you go to a little you know order off online little expos expedition type tarantulas for anybody knowing so maybe if you want to get them cheaper maybe you order off online you pay the fee off online the fee would probably be like basically these three and this would be the fee for shipping and handling if you want to order off online or you go to an expo or you know you can order them from a private seller which that's basically where the profits came from right here as far as ordering them off online from a private basically somebody that's private selling them like you or me so that's why they overprice so anybody that's going to be you know talking like yo you could have got that for cheaper yeah i know but the heat at the moment guy seemed to be kind of like he needed help selling these guys and i didn't like seeing them in as you can see the containers that they gave them to me in it was like literally just sitting there in these type of containers and I'm just like man why you got them all them little containers you know so purchased them happy I do got them though definitely gonna show you them eating as well so let me just get into these little homes so got some little stuff down Ooh, don't fall Got some little stuff down. By the way, I got this, this little, these little plants off online. They cheap. Go to your Dollar Tree store. Got the little capsule off online. That's also cheap too. Little Dollar Tree store. My next video, I'm gonna show you guys exactly what to look for if you're looking for little cups like that. Go to little Dollar Tree store and get them. But I'm gonna show you exactly what's the plastic next time when I buy another pair of uh, these little cups, little cup drinks I call them. So. That's pretty much how that one looks. Pretty much the same. Pretty much the same. As you can see, a little bit of webbing is already spitting out right there. That was from Big Head over here. So, pretty much the same. It's all clumped up. 
So I most likely is gonna put these guys inside these little, well, these better enclosures than these, but these are too small. So, I don't know, should I do a feeding of them right now? You know what, let me jump into the feeding too. Let me give y'all a bonus, since y'all sticking with me watching this. Let me feed the white knee first. Let me turn it this way. So as you can see, I got the crickets as well. Brought some crickets. So we gonna get into this. Let me just get into this, man. Nobody come here just to see no me talking around my mouth. Everybody came here to see this. And we're gonna drop this on top. Hold on. Let me see. Come on! Okay. Alright. So we're gonna get straight into this feeding video. You don't waste nobody time coming to my thing to come see. Don't be scared. You get it in the light. Get away from the light. Alright, so if you could eat on camera, this will make the video 100% better for showing off the enclosure setups that I showed off. I already got the same equal earth for that stuff too, by the way. Come on. Ain't nobody gonna eat? Come on. Uh, get up in there. Hopefully you attack it. So we could at least see that on camera. So let me just jump into the next one. Cause you ain't gonna eat on camera. I'm gonna put you over here. So I could at least have you both in my range. Okay, so obviously somebody's running from them. Maybe when I put them in, maybe when y'all go in y'all enclosures, maybe y'all eat then. It's, maybe it's too small for y'all to eat. I was hoping I had somebody that's probably most likely violent. Let me see. Let me get up in here. Okay, so let me just do one by one in each enclosure. Let me just get into this and finish in this enclosure video. So this one, as you can see, I got the same stuff. I'm not gonna repeat the same stuff over. So I actually, I do got a little shelter thingy for it. So actually, I'm gonna use this. This is a can. Oh, you gonna attack it when I just saw it. I got a thing. I just turned the camera away from you. I slightly caught it though. I slightly caught it when I was putting the can inside there. Okay. So I'm gonna have to dump you out so we can get a better view. Come on. And I can't give you the can because we gonna have to zoom in on this. Come on, fat butt. Ah! Oh, so it ate two of the crickets? Cause I threw two crickets in there. Yeah, so. So you a champ. So, it grabbed both of the crickets. Oh, matter of fact. Yeah, you grab both. Okay. It looked like one was in there. I don't know. Wait. Oh, cricket ran in there that fast? Wow. Okay, cricket's on point. So, at least y'all slightly got to get that on video. Uh, at least that one got on video. 
And I also got like a little top for this one. So, okay. I had some little, for the pink toe. Trying to do this with one hand. It's causing for a whole upbrail. If you don't get your butt over here. Ah! Trying to attack me. Come on! Why are you trying to come out? I don't want to see you right now. Uh, so as you can see, these guys are real fast climbers. As you can see, he giving me a little fight right there. Woo! So you can see the shadow right there in the light. See that shadow right there? That's the, that, that, that's the pink toe right there, giving me a fight. Close you up. Ugh, try to bite my nails, you seen that? Try to bite my fingers, I ain't got time to be getting bit. <laughs> it's like, nah, they didn't try to bite me. By the way, these things are like rarely biting people. That was just me playing with y'all, by the way. So if anybody watching is probably gonna get nervous or scared. They rarely bite. And this one gonna attack off camera as well. Again. Some of these uh, things are completely harmless as far as like poison and stuff like that go. So that's just for everybody to go. You could probably do your own research, look them up. So, but as you can see how fast the pink toe was, that's why they suggest nobody ever holds these things because you don't want to end up getting bit and he running off, running around your house, you know. So you're going to attack off camera as well. So that didn't help me at all. Uh... Okay. Uh -huh. So, beautiful. I'll be seeing you later. No, you're not about to jump out. You made me upset. All of y'all made me upset because y'all ain't even get on camera and, and attack just to pray like I wanted y'all to. Let me see. I just grabbed the same container. Again, did I just grab the same container? Yes, you did. Put that one over there. And bam! So I get a little bit of webbing going on in here. Do these guys in here so I can do the review. So this is the curly head. Get out! So that's the curly head. Man, that's pretty much it. I also got tops for them as well too. But that's, I had to put this camera down. So yeah, I just closed out this quick little video I wanted to do with these guys. So, white knee, pink toe, curly head, striped knee. And uh, fast. And those like to climb, by the way. They really like to climb. They love climbing. I'm gonna be putting him in a different enclosure or she in a different enclosure that's gonna be upward so it can climb properly so it don't have to be on a land. Land, land, they like to be on land, land, climber. So I'm gonna get that in the climbing thing as well too. So yeah. So i just like to say peace for right now. I'm gonna catch you in my next vlog. And uh, yeah. And I hope none of these crickets actually got out either. But I'm going to say peace right now. Peace.